Oh my God, I thank the Lord for this word, you know. I have a special word for somebody right now. Let us talk. Let us, not, let us talk, okay? This is very important because it is easy. Let me assure you, there are people that are real snakes in our lives and we tend to tolerate them. But there are those that just make a minor mistake and we don't even hesitate. We don't even want to reason it out. We just strictly apply it on them and we punish them big time. Whereas a real snake that needs that punishment, we end up forgiving them with ease. It is common. I like what my pastor says when she sees people uh, stopping go coming to church, maybe because a, a pastor rebuked them once about something. That at your home, don't you sometimes go through uh, some quarrelings or some misunderstanding and you have to be rebuked? Do you leave that home and say, this is no longer my family? No, you be angry for a moment, but you end up forgiving one another. You stay there. You've been having many quarrels. So she was like, even the house of the Lord is like that. Sometimes you'll go through situations where you have to be rebuked. And it doesn't sit well with you, but it does not mean you must just quit the church and go to another one. Because even where you are going, there will be a trouble. And I want to talk to somebody right now that they don't be quick to just look at a mistake, that person's mistakes. That is a real person for you. Yes, they might mess up a little bit, but that does not mean you have to write them off and stop calling them your sister, your brother, and all these things. There are some people that we tolerate who did not deserve a second chance. I speak reconciliation. I don't know who's going through this, but myself, I remember I've been once in these positions time and time again. I was like, you know what? This perfect is a good person all my life. Why can I be angry with them just because they made this one mistake? If they really hated me, they wouldn't have gone to this extent of doing this. Let me just accept that they are a human being. They also make mistakes. If they are to get out of my sight for good, let it be unto them, not because of a small minor misunderstanding. And I pray, let the Lord be for you in Jesus' name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details on the comment section below. See you next time.